Hey guys, welcome back to Techogram. Today we're gonna learn what is a template function in C++. So let's get started. First we will take an example. Suppose in a house there are three rooms. Room 1, room 2, room 3. So for all the three rooms you have three keys so every time you want to open a room you have to search for the key which will get fit in all these locks either you can mark these keys or like break the lock or you can use a master key which will open all these three locks so what I want to explain with this example suppose we have a class and in that we have three different function we want to find the maximum of two numbers two integer and two float numbers so we have to declare three different functions so for the first we have to write an integer function and for the second we have to write a character function and then the third we will write a float function so instead of writing three different function you can write one generic function which will be useful for all these three functions so that is called a function template so we will see an example as i said we will write a program to find the maximum number or maximum character or maximum float number so first we will include our header file so as usual now how to declare a template function so syntax to declare a template function is first the keyword template then the less than symbol and the keyword class then you have to write a variable so we will use t here this is user defined and now we will create a function max and we will call it three times by giving three different values so to create a function using template class we have to use the keyword which is the variable name t here and then name of the function so from the void main we will send two values to our function so we have to create two objects here for example if it was a simple function we have to create like integer and integer a comma character a so if it is a template we have to create t and the name of the variable and then again because there are two values required so we will write t and again a user defined variable now in the program we will write our simple condition that if a is greater than b then return a so it will return the number which is which will be the maximum and else so there are only two numbers so return b and we'll close our function now in the void main we have to call this function so we will we can directly at the right c out maximum maximum of integer is and we'll call our function so to call the function you can directly call it here so we will call max because the function because the name of the function is max you can see here max and then we have to pass the value so as i said we will pass two integer value two character value and two float value so first we will pass two integer value 10 comma 20 we will write for the maximum of character is and we will pass two character here so again call your function max and then we will pass two characters so our character will be a and second character we can pass u so character are classified according to the ascii value they hold and the third will be our float value so maximum of float is and we'll call the same function and pass two float values so we can pass 5.03 comma you can and write 8.6 and now we will write gets here so that we can see the output and to display these messages in a new line we will write slash n again a slash n here and a slash n and a slash n here and we can write slash t so that there is some space this is tab slash t for tab and slash n for new line now we will run our program and see whether it's working or not so first i will explain what is happening here suppose when we call our max function with the value 10 and 20 this value passed here so the 10 is saved in a now and the b is saved in b now then it will compare whether if a is greater than 10 so 10 is greater than 20 condition will be false so it will return b so number which will be displayed here will be 20 and then it will call the second function which is c out maximum of character is then max a u so the value of a the ascii value of a is lower than the u 
so here u will be printed and the third you can see 8.6 is 8.6 is greater than 5.03 so it will get printed so this is as you can see i have not written like integer character float here this is a generic function now before running the program we will write the clear screen so the output of any previous program will be cleared and now we'll run the program let's see if there is an error yes there is an error we will rectify this straight when missing so this error occur if you forget to write a semicolon at the end of any statement you can see i have not written semicolon here now we'll run the program once again and you can see maximum of integer is 20 maximum of character is u and maximum of float is 8.6 so this is how you can use the function template in c++ hope you like the video if you like the video please press the like button if you have any comment question query or suggestion please leave that in the comment box i'm happy to help subscribe for more bye